Happy Thursday, YouTube family, YouTube friends. Today I am back with nine immediately higher work from home job leads where you can make up to 2080 per week. That is great money. Also, if you need help paying your bills or you need food or you need a free laptop or maybe a low cost laptop, I'm going to show you a free organization where they're going to help you. As well as if you need free training, I'm going to show you an organization that will help you get to where you need to be. And then also stop paying people to do your resumes for you. I'm going to show you a free tool that you can use that will optimize your resume. I'm going to walk you step by step so you can go ahead and get that job, okay? So you know that I get excited every time when I share my screen because there is room at the table for everyone to partake. Remember, God has a job out there for you, but you got to take action. And remember that these are a mixture of no talk and work from home job leads as well as customer service jobs if you want to be on the phone. So we're going to go ahead and dive right into the first job. The first job is with the company Underdog Fantasy. They're seeking CRM coordinators to work from home, okay? Now, when I say explore within the company, go right here where it says view all jobs. They have part-time and full-time jobs. I mean, explore within the company and see if there's any other jobs in here that may be a good fit for you. But when we scroll down, the salary is between 63 thousand to seventy thousand um, per year and that's between thirty to thirty three dollars an hour now when we dive in a little bit deeper you're going to create launch and maintain scalable and data-driven cross-channel marketing campaign you're going to engage convert and increase the ltv of new assistant ud users as well as you're going to leverage automation automation tools to develop continued transactional promotional and evergreen user content strategy. Now with the job, they want you to have a marketing uh, experience anywhere between one to three years experience managing life cycle marketing or digital marketing campaign. They want you to be organized, strong attention to detail, techno savvy and able to pick up new tools quickly. Okay. So if this is something you want to do, all you need to do is go ahead and apply immediately. Now, the great thing or the great perks about this job, they're going to give you $500 home office alliance, which is great here. They do have 401k match and then unlimited PTO. Okay. So if this is something you want to do, scroll down like I'm doing and fill out your application and and submit it so you can go ahead and increase your chances of getting hired. Now, opportunity number two is with the company Process Unity. They're seeking assessment coordinators to work from home. This is a full-time position. If you're looking for a part-time job, I say explore within the company and see if there's any other opportunities that may be a good fit for you. But when I scroll down, I'm looking to see how much the salary is. The salary is between $42,000 to $50,000, depending on your experience. And that's around $20 to $24 an hour. Hour. Now, when we dive in just to see what you're going to be doing, you're going to help third parties by email, phone, and other live support channels as they move through the assessment life cycle. You're going to also collaborate with a wide array of internal teams to keep third parties informed and moving forward. And then we go down a little bit further. They want you to have experience in a professional customer service role, working with multiple customers or vendors at a time, excellent verbal and written communication skills, and then in interest and risk assignment and cyber security, okay, and comfortable making and receiving phone calls, providing support in real time, okay? Now, if you, a bonus point is if you're familiar with working with Zendesk. So if this is something you want to do, all you need to do is click right here where it says apply for this job. This is job number two, okay? Job number three is with this company, Montel. They're seeking executive assistant to work remotely. Remember, these companies reached out to me and they said, we are looking to hire people immediately. So I just want to share this out here you know, with you. When we scroll down, we're looking to see how much the salary is going to be. Let me just go back up here and see how much the salary. The salary is between 100K to 100K a year. That is between 48 an hour to $52 an hour. And when we dive in a little bit deeper, um, the little information about uh, what they want you to do is basically this role will also take the lead on rhythm of the business planning, including logic on company events, board meetings and leadership meetings, as well as participating with the people team on the other clerical task. So that's what you're going to be doing. OK, you're going to be working directly with CEOs and CCO while supporting other members of the C-suite to prioritize day to day traveling, expense and meeting schedules. OK, so they're looking for someone 
Um, if you love playing the role of, as an event manager and providing a lasting impression with not just their executive and team, but ex external guests as well, they're looking for you. Uh, they want you to have four years of executive assistant experience, support senior level executive and on board or direct, preferable in the finance, fintech or tech world, a bachelor's degree in expertise with G Suite application and require. I want to stop right there. Don't let that scare you. If you are walking in the favor of God, God can allow different hiring managers and companies overlook a lot of things. I talk about that all the time because the job that I've been on for 14 years, it requires a bachelor's degree, master's degree. I don't have that, y'all. I only have a social degree, a high school diploma and certification. I do have a PhD because I praise God daily. I praise him daily. So I do have a PhD. But again, don't you know disqualify yourself before you apply for these jobs. Let the company do it. You got to believe in yourself because if you don't believe in yourself, nobody else will. So go out there and grab what the Lord has for you today. And the great thing about this company, they do offer remote setup alliance of $400, which is great. Um, great opportunity. So if this is something that you want to do, then all you need to do is scroll down and fill out the application. This is opportunity number three. Now, opportunity number four, when you scroll up, is SI. They're talking, they're hiring for renewals, coordinators to work from home. And when I scroll down, I'm looking for the salary here. The salary is between $15 to $16 an hour. Now, when we dive in a little bit deeper, you're going to work closely with team members to present renewal quotes and close renewal opportunities for the clients. You're going to identify any missing information needed during a customer's renewal process to ensure their customers have their questions answered and the coverage their employees are counting on. You're going to also schedule and conduct renewal meetings with clients to review their coverage needs. Now, what they want you to bring to the table is one to three years experience and customer service experience productive with good multitasking skills, passion for helping people, oral and written communication skills. And what they have to offer is, again, 401k, FSA plan, generous stock option package, competitive compensation. So if this sounds like something that you're able to do, then scroll down like I'm doing and fill out the application. This is job number four, okay? Job number five, we're going to go all the way up. It's with the company Tridit Care. They're seeking accounts receivable rep, third party government to work from home. And when I scroll down, they do not list the salary, but I take upon myself to research these, even though it says August the 8th, 2024, it is still current. Why? Because I reach out to hire manager on all of these jobs to just double check. But even though it doesn't have the salary, the salary, according to Glassdoor, is between $23 to $30 per hour for this position, okay? And when we dive in a little bit deeper, you're going to prepare and edit and ensure all claims are submitted accurately and timely per pair contracting guidelines. You're going to manage claim assignment via work queues and a work list and ensure proper follow-up is performed on the accounts for cash resolution. Keep supervisor advice of any compliance system and or payer trends issue, which may lead to untimely or inaccurate completion of claim submission resolution. And then you're going to contact insurance carriers on a daily basis for claim status and patient information, either by phone or website, determine reason for the lack of payment or underpayment. And then when you go down, the qualification is just resolve problems. They're looking for advanced type of skills, 35 words per minute. You know, all you need to do is go to officialtypingtest.com and you can practice your typing for free. Microsoft Office, go to Microsoft 365 Training where you can learn it for free. And if this is something that you want to do, then make sure you go ahead. It only requires y'all a high school diploma. And if this is something you want to do, make sure you go ahead and apply immediately. All you need to do is click right here where it says apply now. This is opportunity number five. Now, opportunity number six is with the company VXI. They're currently seeking technical service advisor to work remotely. It is full time. Again, if you're looking for part time jobs, explore within the company where it says search all jobs. There's a whole bunch of jobs that you can look and see what is a good fit for you. And when we scroll down, I'm looking to see if I can find the salary for this position here. The salary is $17.31 per hour. OK, now when we dive in a little bit deeper about um, what you're going to be doing on this job. You're going to deliver exceptional customer service by actually listening to customers' concerns, questions, and issues related to their smartphones. Respond promptly and professional to provide technical solution and assistance. You're going to guide customers through step-by-step -step troubleshooting process to identify 
Unresolved technical issues escalate complex or unresolved problems to higher level technical teams if necessary. OK, and when we go down, these are the operation of hours, Mondays through Sundays, 7 a.m. to 10, 15 p.m. Central Standard Time. You must be available to work anytime during certain operating hours, including weekends and holidays. They will train you. OK, you're going to get three weeks of in-class paid training and two weeks on the phone paid training all completed from the comfort of your home. The schedule for training is Tuesday through Saturday from 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. Central Standard Time, and you must be available to attend 100% of your training. No time can be missed, okay? So if this is something you want to do, go ahead and apply. All you need is a high school diploma or equivalent, previous experience in customer support, patient, empathy, ability to multitask, and flexible to work various shifts including again evenings weekends holidays okay if this sounds like something that you're able to do then go ahead and apply for this job these type of jobs move very quickly all you need to do is click right here where it says apply now this is job number six okay job number seven is with the company everlight solar solar i'm sorry about that Event coordinators, they're seeking event coordinators and executive assistant to work from home. Even though it says the city and state, according to high managers, as long as you're in the 50 states, you're eligible to apply. It is full time. Again, if you're looking for part time jobs, explore within the company. They have a lot of part time jobs as well as full time jobs. And the salary is between 30K to 40K a year. And that is around 14 to $19 an hour. When we dive in a little bit deeper, you're going to be booking vineyards and vineyards, vineyards, I'm sorry, and negotiate deals. You're going to be working with vendors and service providers to arrange suppliers, catering staff and entertainment. You're going to also do administrative tasks, including emails and calendar management. And the qualification is you must be 21 years or older. High school graduate, they're talking about a 3.0 by GPA. Don't let that scare you. Just as long as you have a high school diploma, you'll be all right. Excellent organization skills and strong communication skills. If this sounds like something that you're able to do, then make sure you go ahead and apply immediately. And if you want to apply for this job, all you need to do is go right here where it says apply to this position. This is job number seven. Job number eight is with the company R. TX, they're seeking senior administrative staff coordinators to work remotely. Okay. And when I scroll down, I'm looking and see where the salary is going to be. Remember that even though it says August the 1st, the job is still current. I always reach out to a hiring manager just to double check before I just, you know, go out here and do the jobs here. But the salary is between 44000 all the way up to 102000 a year. And that is between $21 to $49 an hour. When we dive in a little bit deeper, you're going to manage on a time constraint in a fast paced work environment and multitask. They want you to be a self starter, detail or techno savvy and possess excellent organization skills, perform a wide range of administrative tasks. OK, so the qualification requires an AA or SA, which is a social degree in science or art or two years post high school training with a minimum of six years of relevant experience experience with Microsoft Office Suite, previous experience as administrative assistant in our related role, and they want you to be a U.S. citizenship is required as only U.S. citizenships are authorized to access the financial management system due to government requirements, okay? And if this sounds like something that you're able to do, then all you need to do is just go ahead and apply right here where it says apply. This is job number eight. Now we're down to job number nine is with Mia Plaza. They're seeking customer service moderator to work from home. Again, it's 100% remote within the U.S. They're hiring for part-time and full-time job, and the salary is between $19 and $23 an hour. And we dive in a little bit deeper. You're going to monitor and review a high volume of student-generated content to ensure adherence to community guidelines. You're going to also provide feedback and address concerns for their students to maintain a positive and welcome environment. And then you're going to participate in training sessions on content moderation techno techniques and tools. So this company will train you. They're looking for someone that's ability to interact with children, excellent attention to detail, strong problem solving and critical thinking skills, growth mindset, if this sounds like something that you're able to do, then make sure you go ahead and apply immediately for this job by clicking here where it says apply now. OK, so I gave you nine work from home job leads that these companies are hiring immediately. They reached out to me. They're looking to hire you. OK, so I want to go over um, 
different organizations. Uh, I pray every single day and I'm, I'm giving you jobs and I'm going to always give you remote jobs. But there's a lot of people that are struggling, even though while they're looking for a job, they're having a hard time paying their utility bills or they may want to work from home and you can't afford a laptop. So these different organizations will either give you free laptops or low cost laptop. And if you need this resource, reach out to me and I don't have any problem emailing it to you. Just bear with me because I'm having a lot of people that are reaching out to me but I will send it to you, okay? But there's the, the company or organization, United Way 211, provides free and confidential assistance to connect individuals with local resource for help with utilities, housing, food, and other essential needs. You're going to go to 211.org. Government assistance program, again, this is only in the United States. They have various federal and state programs offering financial aid for those struggling with bills, including assistance for housing, utilities, food, and health care. You're going to go to benefits.gov. And then when you go down a little bit further, they have a whole bunch of organizations that are out here to help you. You just need to look through it. If you need help getting a free laptop or low cost laptop, PCS for people, they provide low income individual and families with refurbished computers, Internet and digital literacy support. You're going to go to PCS for people. And then the only foundation offer free computers and internet access to low income families with kids in grade K to 12 students in the United States. There are so many resources or organizations out there. So it's no excuse for you to be struggling, living paycheck to paycheck. Don't know how you're going to pay your bills. Reach out to these people. Don't be embarrassed. Okay. You know, you could be doing great today and it's very second. You may need some help, but there is a step. All you need to do is visit the website to understand the eligibility criteria for receiving a free or low, low, low cost laptop. Follow the application process as outlined by each organization. This may include providing proof of income or need. And always explore local resource and community organization as they may have specific programs for providing technology to those in need. Again, if this is something you want, reach out to me. I don't mind helping you. Um, also, free training. A lot of y'all want to up your skills and you just can't afford to go back to school. Then here's some free training where they will pay for your schooling, but certifications and certificates, they don't pay for that. But like this company here, Corsa, they offer free courses from top universities and companies on various topics, including business, computer science and more. While many courses are free to audit, you may need to pay for a certificate. Um, there's different programs out here that will help you. Um, I'm taking one program, HubSpot Academy. It provides free resource and certification in inbound marketing, content marketing, social media marketing, more. But there's different resources out there to help you stand out from the crowd and be more valuable. Again, if you are looking for this list or if you want it, reach out to me. Bear with me. Give me time. I will respond to you. OK, so this is something that you need to have. I want to talk about resumes, okay? I'm here to help you, and make sure you watch the video all the way to through. So go get your water, your tea, your coffee, whatever the case may be, because I'm going to walk you step by step. I'm going to drop you some gems, and I'm going to show you exactly how to find keywords from a job post and know so you can pass the applicant tracker system. And like I said, stop paying people to do your resume. It's so many people reach out to me, and they have spent their last dime they have spent over $200 and they still can't get a J-O-B and you can literally do it yourself. OK, and I'm going to show you today. Stop paying resume templates. All of this is free. Have you heard of Earn Better? Have you heard of Earn Better? Earn Better is a it's free. I've been using Earn Better for over eight or nine months now, and it is 100 percent free. All you have to do is sign up. The great thing about this platform is you can search for remote jobs. But I ask you to do your own research for a peace of mind. Make sure you always go to the company website and apply for these jobs. But you can search for work from home jobs. and You can find work from home jobs on these platforms. Also, you can track jobs. Every job that you apply for, it tracks the jobs that you apply. And then also talking about interviewing. A lot of times people don't have anybody to role play. It will role play with you. All you have to do is hit start practicing. Whatever job that you apply for, like I apply for ABC Legal for this court support specialist, I can hit start practicing. And on the other end is a pre-recorded answering three interview questions at 
at my own pace, take them to my profile and job, and they would grade your response, provide feedback instantly, and you keep improving. So I'm going to show you the interview sheet sheet. Okay, so AI has created a um, interview sheet sheet for this company, ABC Legal, and getting me prepared on what type of questions hiring manager, a recruiter, or CEO of the company will ask me. But again, it depends on the speed of your internet um, to let you, you know to see when it's going to come up here. So Again, here it is right here. So this is the interview sheet sheet. The great thing about it, they're telling you what they're going to ask you. And they give you an answer. What are your greatest strengths? All you have to do is read the answer and put it in your own words so it can sound natural. What interests you about this job? What do you think will be the most challenged about this role? Can you walk me through your resume? What kind of environment do you thrive in? They're giving you the answers, y'all. This is very, very easy. And then also they're giving you general best practice for interviews like tips and tricks. A lot of times when people go into interview, the, the hiring manager or recruiters are asking questions. And when they ask you, do you have courses? No, I don't have any courses. That makes you look like that you're not interested in the job. You need to always, always ask questions. And they're giving you questions right here that you can ask, like, how long have you been with the company? What's your favorite part about working here? What are the next step in the interview process? Ask some type of question, y'all, so people can know that you're interested in the job. When I go into documents, you can do resume, cover letters. You can create docs, thank you emails. You can always, it's very important after the interview, always send a thank you email. Follow up after you apply for these different jobs. Follow up. You can do follow up email. So I'm going to show you a resume here. If you are new and have never signed up with Earn Better, you're going to have to upload your resume. Once your resume is uploaded, you can say yes, tailor insisted Earn Better resume, or you can say no, upload and start from scratch. I'm going to show you how to start from scratch. If you have a resume, you want to always upload it as a PDF file. According to Hiring Manager, PDF files are more readable and, it, and, and the ATS can read those type of files better. But if I don't have a resume, don't no worry, I can click on that and say I don't have a resume and I can start from scratch. OK, so high works is whatever job that you're interested in applying for. OK, say, for example, I just want to apply for VXI and I want to do this techno service advisor to work remotely. OK, I'm going to copy and paste that title. Or you can come in here and you can start typing techno. It's just up to you, whatever is easy for you. I like to copy and paste the title word for word. And then you hit save and continue. Now, this is my resume. It's building my resume for me. Okay. Now, when I say stop paying for resume template, it's people on this platform that are charging anywhere from 10 all the way up to $30 or more for a resume template. And y'all, you can do it for free. Here are you. This is all you need. Something that is simple. You have classic, bold, clean and moderate. I say stick with the classic and the clean so it can pass the applicant tracking system. To me, these type the bold and moderate, it can confuse the applicant tracking system. OK, so I say, again, stick with the classic and clean. All you do is go to content, put it in your name. I'm going to show you. I'm going to put my name in here. OK, my name is I'm sorry, it's not spelled right here. Um, and then I can put my last name. This is my email address. I can put my phone number here. And I can put the city in the state here. And if I have a LinkedIn profile, I can put it there. You can choose to do a summary or you can switch it to objective. I'm going to switch it to objective. I'm going to say seeking a techno service advisor remote to work from home or whatever is I know it don't sound right but I'm gonna get AI to rewrite it for me so I can hit rewrite objective with AI and this is what the original looked like this is suggestion one look how it's doing it for me suggestion two suggestion three I can choose so I'm gonna choose suggestion three and I'm hit apply edits and then I'm gonna take this objective off you see how it took something that was plain and made it more professional where it can increase my chances of getting a job. Now your work experience, you want to add your work experience. Like if you work, say for example, if I did data entry, I'm going to put all of that in there. And then if I worked for this company here, I can put that information. I could put a land of whatever city and state that you work. You can put down your start date. If I started July, 2022 to currently working there, you can do so. 
And then you want to put the description for your job. Say, for example, if this was my resume and this is, is what I actually do. Let me let me just make something here up here right quick. I actually did this here. I'm going to have to do this uh, word for word. Deliver exceptional customer service. I'm going to go in here and add this in here. Okay, I'm going to hit enter. I'm going to go back to the job rec and add this here. This is what I actually did on my job if I was working on the job here. Okay, and we're going to go back and add one more um, job duty that I did on this particular job as a technical support. Go in here and add that in here. That's all I have to do. Okay, and it automatically saves it for me. Okay, then I can go to education and I can add my education. If I only have a high school diploma, I can add my high school diploma in there. Let me go back and say high school diploma. And then usually it's general education for a high school diploma. And then I could put down, you know, what school that I attended, if it was Amazon or whatever the school is. And then I put down Orlando, Florida, and I could put my graduation date, January 2024. And if I had any certifications, I could add my certifications. I could put whatever it is. I'm just showing you here how easy it is. I got a certification from Amazon and I completed it in 2024, okay? Now, the thing about the skills here, y'all, okay, what it did was it took the title that I, the job that I was searching for was techno support, and it came up with, gave me some suggestions, skills to add to help me pass the Africa Tracker system. I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put all of them in there because I want my, my resume to increase its chances of passing and making it. Uh, past the Africa Tracker system. So you can download it, you can share, you can hit finish, and I'm going to hit finish. Okay. So this is my resume here. So if I go back in it, this is what my resume looked like, y'all. This is what it looks like. It took me literally five minutes or less to make my own resume. So that's why I say stop paying people to do your resume. I am a job coach. I do resume review. I do interview prep. But look, I want to be a blessing to anybody. I'm not about taking people's money. My blessings come when I know everybody is getting a job. A lot of people have reached out to me and say, look, just by using Earn Better, I received interviews. Um, I got a job. So that's make my day is you're getting a job. OK, so this is something that is very easy to do. And if I want to go back and I see something that is that I need to edit, all you need to do is go into content. And you go to the spot where you want to edit. You can either delete this or you can just hit these, this down area. You can go in and edit and change things around to the best of your ability. That's how easy it is. That's why I say stop paying people for your resume. Okay. Now, I want to show you something here. If you made it this far, this is going to be a game changer here. Okay. You hear all the time is people say optimize your resume, optimize optimize your resume to the job post. And a lot of people don't know what are the keywords in the job post. Okay. I'm going to tell you y'all chat GPT is free. Okay. Sign up for chat GPT. All you need to do is go into one of these jobs. I'm going to show you which job that I went in and I copy and paste. Hold on just for a second. I went into this job here, right? I went into this job and basically what I did was I highlight when I say it's keywords in this job post. And a lot of times you don't know what keywords are in this job post. Basically, what I did was I highlight everything in this job post. I went all the way to just a job post and I copy and paste that in chat GPT. And I just basically say, give me the keywords from this job description that will help my resume pass the applicant tracking system. So when I did all of that. It came up with all the skills and experience. It gave me the keywords and phrases from the job description that would help my resume pass the applicant tracking system. So these are all the keywords that you need to implement into your resume where it can be natural, you know, where it could be natural. So if I wanted to use one of these keywords, I'm going to give you an example. I'm going to put this keyword present renewal quotes. I've already went into one of my um, resume and I put uh, present renewal quotes. And then what I did on the job was prepare, edit, and ensure all claims are submitted. I basically told ChatGPT to put this keywords 
in the sentence to sound natural past the ATS. And this is what it came up with. OK, so basically, if hiring manager go on the back end and they hit pre present present renewal quotes, if I have that in my resume, then my resume is going to be pulled up for a callback for an interview. I've tried it myself and I have received offers for an interview. So this works. So take advantage of this. This is free 99 to you. So go ahead and take advantage of this today. Um, I'm here to help you as much as I can. Um, Earn Better is a great platform where you can go in. Like I said, you can do cover letters. You can do thank you emails. You always want to do a thank you email after you do a job interview. You want to follow up. Like say, for example, I can show you. If you want to follow up after you apply for a job, if I apply for this techno support job, I'm going to just copy and paste this techno support information and to earn better. OK, and then it's asked me, hold on just for a second. What job did what job title did you apply for, which was this here? What company did you apply for? It wants to know the company's name. So VXI. So I want to put VXI. OK, and then I want to put John Doe or Johnny Jones right here. And then all you need to do is hit save and continue. And then it says, tell us about this role. Um, you can choose how you want this um, letter to be made. The position line with my career goals, my skills and knowledge are very relevant. I'm excited about your team. I'm just going to choose that, hit save and continue. And then it's analyzing the job requirement, customizing all of this for me. And look, it took me less than five minutes to come up with a follow up, you know, and that's what you need to do. If you a lot of y'all saying I'm applying for jobs and I'm not hearing back, do a follow up and let AI or, or earn better um, write it for you. That's very easy. And all you hit is finish and you're done. OK, only thing you need to know is when you do a resume, you're only titled to do 15 resumes. Right. So if you do 15 resume, you're not going to be able to do another one. All you need to do, don't get in panic mode, is delete the one that you're not using, and, and that's it. And you can do a resume. Take advantage of this, y'all. I'm here to help you as much as I can. I want to be a blessing to you. I want you to share this information with everyone um, you know, that needs help. I'm here to help you. I want everybody to get a job. I'm doing my part, but you got to do your part, okay? Now, if this video has been helpful, you know what I want you to do is hit that like button as well as leave a comment, y'all. I will respond. I respond to all of my comments because I enjoy talking to you. I love interacting with you. Also, subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to build a community where we can uplift and encourage one another on our job search and everyday life. And if you want to be a part of that ride, you have to subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to share these videos on your social media platform so more and more people can see what I have to offer each and every single day. And you know that I'm going to leave some encouraging words with you because we need more positive people in the world that is speaking life over us and ourselves. It is just so much negative in the world. A lot of people think because they can't do something, you can't do it. You got to realize you are two different people. And in the word of God, it says, I can do all things through Christ Jesus that strengthen me. So you have to believe in yourself because if you don't believe in yourself, nobody else will. You got to go out there and grab what the Lord has for you. God has a blessing and he said, come and get it. But a lot of y'all are too scared to get out there because you're scared you're going to fall. You got to understand when God is taking you to the next level, you got to trust him. If you want to go to the other side, you're going to have to go through the storms of life. Many times you're going to have to go through the rain, but you better put on your rain cap your raincoat and go through that storms because you know for a fact through the storms the sun will shine again and that's what you have to realize that and stop disqualifying yourself before you apply for these jobs let the company do it too many times they're not gonna hire me because i don't have four years experience they're not gonna hire me because of this you're making excuses stop making excuses say well what a case if they do hire me, I'm going to step out on faith. I'm going to get out of my comfort zone. A lot of y'all are in your comfort zone and scared to take action. A lot of people are complacent. They don't want to look for no other job because they say, hey, I've been on this job for six months. They're not going to let me go. I'm here to tell you, you're going to be on a job for 30 years. They don't care if you ain't never missed a day in your life. They will let you go. That's why I talk about have multiple strains of income because in the word of God, Ecclesiastes 11 and 2, go check it out and read it on your own time. It says not seven, but eight multiple strains of income because you never know what can happen on the land. Too many times people get complacent. They go to a job, they give them a gift card, then they don't want to look. This company loves me. Or they give you a gift basket during the holidays. You don't want to move. That is just a distraction to keep you from moving to the next level. 
always have a backup plan, y'all. I always use the scenario cars. You drive it every single day, whether if it's on a car, you're riding a bus. If God forbid something happened where it, you have a flat tire, there's a spare tire in that car in the back of the trunk that you can put on your car. Hopefully you go get it fixed, but it could take you to your destination. We're all on cell phones. Everywhere you go, everybody's on a cell phone. And we could be talking and the conversation is good. You have a charger where you can go and charge your phone up, y'all. So you need to have a backup plan like that with your life. Too many times people become homeless is because they don't plan and plan and, and prepare. You have to plan. The holidays coming up pretty soon, and a lot of people are going to plan what we're going to have for Thanksgiving. Who's going to be there? Where is it going to be at? You need to plan with your life. Don't wait until you lose your job and you get in panic mode and like, what is I going to do? You know, because when you lose your job, it's like a job. It's a job looking for a job. But as long as you have a job, you have a lot of recruiters, people reaching out to you. Always weigh your option. Have options. When you go into these companies, they don't only hire one person. There's billions and thousands of people that are working for their company. And if they decide to let you go, they have your replacement. They can train that person to do your job. Never think that you're not replaceable. Furniture replaceable. Wall pictures replaceable. Refrigerators, washing dryers, clothes are replaceable. And you can be replaceable at any time. So don't get complacent, y'all have multiple strains of income, have a backup plan at all being necessary because it's in the word of God. That's what God wants you to do is have multiple strains of income. Believe in yourself because if you don't believe in yourself, nobody else will, y'all. You got to pat yourself on your back and say, I know I can do it. Because the word of God says I can do all things to Christ Jesus. You can do it. I believe in you. Keep pushing. Prayer changes things. Prayer is like a key. It will unlock doors that you thought you never could walk in. A lot of times people are sitting on jobs like, how in the world did I get in this job? All you can say is God's grace and mercy towards you. You know, you were favored by God. And when you walk in the favor of God, a lot of people are not going to like it. But you can't stop the blessings of what God has on people's life. So remember, keep pushing. Keep applying. Never, ever give up. Don't disqualify yourself before you apply for these jobs. Let the company do it. Many blessings to each and every one of y'all. And I'm praying whatever you desire in your heart, it shall be given in the name of Jesus. Go out there and grab your blessing. God's throwing that blessing at you. Don't give up. He's going to throw the towel back at you. Speak life over yourself because the power of the tongue determines life and death. You got this. Stay prayed up at all times. Many blessings to y'all, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.